A presents Coppa Italia. Starting lineup tonight, Alex Merritt in goal, as he was against Udinese at the Wolves again here this evening. In front of him, Samuele Damiani comes into midfield, and up front, Marco Oliveri appeared three times. So how much does it all mean to Empoli? I think that's one of the biggest questions. Just what you want to do, unfortunately. Fawazi Gulam, the old reliable, comes back into the side, and uh, Phil, of course, coming in from that flank. They've got to be clever in the loan market. They appear to have done that again. May. That's a nice little one down the side to Lozano, who got turned. They wanted an offside. Presentable, very presentable opportunity early on here for Herving Lozano. Well, he's completely unmarked. Look, he just comes off the defender. He would have just been offside. The turn gets his shot in. Good save. Do need to be watched. Oliveri goes to the outside, changed his mind and lost his footing all at once. Yeah, he slipped. But really should a joyous moment in a desperately difficult time. Now the goalkeeper's going to drop on that without a problem for Lant. Yeah, I think the big thing in Italy is obviously winning. Do him nicely. Well, it's a strange appointment for many, including myself. I thought, you know, the way he likes to play football. And first game of the cup run. Decent ball in. And Oliveri read it. Kept his feet better there as well. Yeah, it's good movement from him as well. Lovely ball in, but he just can't get enough power on it. Panel. Did well. Oh. Top corner, brilliantly headed in. And uh, they've gone in front. Di Lorenzo came across from right back against his former club. He gives Napoli the lead. That's a brilliant header. Di Lorenzo, but he's been trying to get forward all the time. He was hungry to get into the box and try and make things happen. That's a really good header. Gulam takes it. Off the gloves of Terzic down the left. Again, Empoli showing what they've got for how they want to play. Yeah, to do the high squeeze. He can't do that. I mean, he's 29 now, and most of the Leipzig players are much younger than that. You have to be very youthful, very... F well judged by Merit. Looked to me like Di Lorenzo played them onside on that. That would have been one of the cut goals of the round over the shoulder from Rido Matos, and it clips the top of the crossbar. What an attempt. Brilliant attempt. He nearly kicked his teammate in the, in the head as well. Worry about him, he doesn't score much. <laughs> that would have been a famous moment, and a good stop again by Forlan. Nice and sharp. But Rami. There's no stopping that one either. And they're back on level terms, Empoli. And my goodness, they deserve it. They have played excellently here in this first half. It's 1 1. And what a strike as well it is from Barami. Bravo, Raga. Comes back. Hits it in the goalkeeper, but it doesn't even move. And they've looked good on the counter attack at times, Empoli, and they've got their rewards now. Back on level terms. Gano for Napoli. Gets to the line. Oh. Had to be well defended, it was. Yeah, Castelli at the near post. Oh, another spectacular as Napoli go back in front and Lozano, provider of the first, does it all by himself this time. And again, absolutely no chance for the goalkeeper. Yeah, but this is a horrendous mistake from the young fullback to Pella. It's a crossfield ball which he reads. He tries to control it instead of clearing it, he should have headed it away and went straight to Lozano. Lorenzo. all the changes to their starting league side last time out that they've made tonight. I hear a lot more of some of these players playing for Empoli on loan at the moment from other clubs. I mentioned that victory all those years ago, that famous moment for Empoli, their last win. Mother club next season. Empoli. 
and his players. That's why they did so well so far in the Europa. Settling into their rhythm again well here, Empoli, at the start of the second half. Not the best outcome for Terzic. Di Lorenzo on the same wavelength again. Patania. Um, lovely movement by Deme, making an extra man in there. Back from Napoli. Deflection could be troublesome, and it lands on the top of the net, and Forlan was absolutely rooted, the goalkeeper. Politano from the edge of the box. Yeah, he's waiting for the shot to come in, sets himself, and then it takes the deflection, loops up over. Inside, he did go inside. Petania held it up, turned, miss hit. And if they can get it, and now maybe for Petania. And again, he dwelt before he hit it. And young Vitti stood up to him. Yeah, it's a good battle for the young... was above Koulibaly, actually. But they've got to get... Cambiasso. Moreo again. Side. Inside was Deme. Deme did well again. Oh. It's reached a far corner again. And Meret could not get across. Bajrami does it again from even further out. 2-2. Two -two. Well, it's a brilliant strike. And I don't think the goalkeeper, Merritt, thought he was going to take the shot on from there. But he's taking it on and he's buried it in the back of the net. Brilliant strike. It's another one. Lozano just read it so quickly. Oh, of all the people to do that. Insigne. Yeah, it's just coming to him. Not quite. Well, what were you doing, the goalkeeper? Nigel, they could have conceded three times since they've levelled this time. Lozano didn't give up on it, but Forlan crazily electing in the Coppa tonight, coming later, and Forlan has to make another save. They've gone all quiet since they levelled at 2-2 again. Not the greatest hit by Ruiz, was it? No, it wasn't, but I think he's off. Still, they believe, and now they go the more aerial route, and... Opportunity so far in his career. Lozano again, he's very good at finding room, Lozano away. Off the line first time, but it's tucked in second time. Uh, Patania will claim it, I think, and Napoli go back in front at 3-2 in this cup tie, which is continuing to give us no end of entertainment. But frankly, Empoli should have put a stop to all that. Every time Empoli score, they look more vulnerable than ever. They do, but I just wonder what the goalkeeper's doing here. He's on his line and the ball's in the six yard box. Look, you've got to come and punch that. You're the Nhận định bóng đá Napoli với Empoli. Napoli với Empoli. Đôi bên vốn chẳng xa lạ gì nhau. Empoli không ít mùa được sự Serie A và gần nhất ở mùa giải 28-29. Tuy nhiên vào lúc này trong khi em Napoli được câu lạc bộ vẫn trung bình của giải đấu số 1 Italia thì Empoli đã phải chơi ở hạng 2 Italia.